All right, hey everybody, Rob Satram here from Feedback Crunch, and in this video we're gonna show you if you've purchased Rich Plugins, the plugin that allows you to put your Google My Business reviews onto your WordPress website. Congratulations, I think you found one of the best tools. It's 2019, and I think that this plugin is phenomenal. Just so you know, if you're looking for a way to put Google My Business reviews or your Google reviews onto your website, this is one of the best ways you can do it here on our website. If you go to feedbackrunch.com forward slash reviews, you click on reviews. Now I've just put this in here, but this is aggregating and pulling all of my reviews from Google automatically. Not only that is you can see all the reviews, or if you type in write a review, it will pop up and redirect people to be able to easily review you. So this is an easy way to get Google reviews. Say, hey, go to my website and click reviews on the top. Go to the bottom. There's a button. Say, hit a review. That's an easy way. You can text that to people. That'd be some free advice if you're ever using this. But here's the real problem. You need to find what's called your location ID, right? When you're setting up this rich plugin, you've got this goofy little setup that you need to do. You need to find your Google Places ID. And your Google Places ID is not super easy to find. There's some tutorials. You know, if you hit the um, there's, there's a help button that'll, you go to Google places API. So that link will bring you over here. You're able to search, but not all sites are searchable. So here's a quick and easy way to find your places ID. What you do is you Google your business. So here I've Googled preferred one concrete. You'll see that I've popped up here. Now we're doing optimization to this. This isn't totally set yet. Um, but if you right click and go down to view page source, what you'll see is all the code will pop up. Then all you do is hit Control F or Apple or Command F, and I want you to search for this term, data-pid. When you do that, there's a number of returns that come, but here the data-pid, it's all one word. Um, if you can't see that, it's P-I-D, Paul, P-I-D. The first one, what I've found, is tied to your the ID that you need. So this would be the ID that you need. So when you're setting things up, uh, that's how you find your ID. That's it. Hopefully you will invest in the rich plugins. I don't have any connection to it. I just think it's great. I had been wrestling forever how to do this. And remember, it's between, they've got a free version. I've invested in the professional. You can do 15 sites for $200, five sites for $120, single site, $85. Keep moving forward, folks.